We are at Tel Jezreel, and this is the entrance to the Tel. Philip, tell me a little bit about uh, what is here from the Bible. They have had a palace here on the eastern side, and Jezebel's house was on the city wall with the windows facing east. It's like 1 Kings 21 and 2 Kings 9. The Naboth vineyard was here, 1 Kings 21. Elijah the prophet said on the plot of land called Jezreel, dog shall eat the flesh of Jezebel, 2 Kings 9. King Isaiah came here to recover from the wounds he sustained at Ramallah, or Rama, sorry. Rama, yeah. Rama. <clears throat> the prophet Hosea speaks of the bloodshed in this valley and the restoration of Israel <coughs> will be likened to the restoration of Jezreel Valley in Hosea 1. It's also called the Plain of Ezraelon, which is the Greek form of the name of Jezreel. Okay, so I'm, I'm up now and I'm looking right at Mount Gilboa. And this is the eastern side of where the city wall would have been, Jezebel's. Uh, house was in the city wall and they threw yeah, her off. This, is, yeah, and this we're up on top of Tel Jezreel. This is where the battle that uh, Saul fought and he was killed right here in this valley. And they took him and his sons and they hung the bodies on Beth Sheen, which we're going to be going to just after this. And then coming on around the valley, you see Mount More, which means teacher, just here on the left past the water, the lakes right there in the distance. Okay, for orientation, what you can see over there, this is the town of Nazareth. You see the cliff, we're going to drive there. Who controlled this city? It's in the center. Megiddo was on the side, but this was actually in the center controlling the whole Jezreel Valley from this side. So who controlled it? Control all this way, the riverbed, the main road crossing from the Mediterranean to the Jordan Valley over there. That's the main road. And they're coming from Haifa, from uh, Megiddo, from anywhere to Beit Sha'an and then to Jordan. That was the main connection with the, between the Via Maris and the King's Highway that was in the Jordanian side. What we can see here, this is the uh, uh, Mount Gilboa. Mount Gilboa, on the foot of Mount Gilboa, behind the last reservoir over there, that's the region of uh, the spring of Gidon, Gidon Spring and it's called Harod. Harod Spring providing the water to make all this. Sounded more fantastic, oh, but that was wrong. Okay. Yes, thank you. <laughs> but uh, who knows how God whittled down his 10,000. Talking about Gideon. Gideon. Uh, Those that were scared go home. Okay, okay, so then lastly, who was chosen to be part of his band? Okay, now lap like a dog. I was here on another guide, uh, another tour, and the guide was sure that that meant he chose the worst possible people. He said these would be people who got down and put their face in the water and lapped like a dog. That's option, his option. I said, no, that's not what happened. I said, uh, they did it this way, kept their spear and cupped the water and lapped like a dog this way. And he was sure I was wrong, and I was sure I was right, and I checked the text, and uh, right. of course, I'm still sure I'm right, <laughs> but uh, you have two views, two views. And did God uh, let him keep the worst, that, that magnifies God more, or did God uh, have him keep the, the 300 most alert, whatever the situation, I want you to understand, it's right in front of your eyes, this is where... Uh, you have the story of Gideon and, and, and the breaking of the pitcher and the, and the pot of light and, and God. You understand what I want you to see that and feel that here, okay? Secondly, I want you to know that after David died, you have Israel divided into two sections. You have the northern kingdom. How many tribes in the northern kingdom? Ten. Ten. You have the southern kingdom. How many left? Two. Two, Two right. Well, where's, where for the most part is the capital of the northern kingdom? Samaria. Samaria, right. Now, Samaria is in the heart of the West Bank. We can't go to Samaria. But the summer palace, Ahab and Jezebel had a summer palace right here. And the uh, apartment of the king and queen was on the east side. In which direction is east? There you have East.
There you have Mediterranean, west. There you have north. There you have south. So it faced east. So somewhere right along, the, maybe right up on the top of that hill behind you was Je Jezebel's palace. All right? This is where she is thrown down and the dogs eat her after the chariots run over her. You remember the story? And uh, all that was left was the what? The palms of her hand and parts of her feet. Right, soles of her feet. Now, where was Naboth's vineyard? If they looked out the window and saw a coveted the vineyard, what direction do you suppose Naboth's vineyard is going to be when the windows were looking out the east? This is all terraces from the biblical time. You can see the terraces on the slope of the hill. Okay. Now, what, looking right here, here you have vine plants. These are vines, grapes. And I want you to imagine that this is part of Naboth's vineyard. It could be. I mean, obviously, it's a, uh, in the right area. Let's put it that way. And uh, so you want to say, did, did you get to see Naboth's vineyard?